there is a recent surge in the reports by the users that Warzone started to crash with error 6.154. The issue is usually reported to occur after a game's update. There are mixed disk read errors like, disk read error, 6.154, global.stream.mp, fp. In this guide, I'm going to show you how to resolve the issue mentioned above so just follow through with the guidelines provided. Method 1. Update the PC's windows to the latest build. Warzone might crash with error 6.154 if the PC's windows is outdated as the system's OS may have become incompatible with the game and other system modules. Here, updating the PC's windows to the latest build may solve the Warzone problem. Method 2. Launch Warzone as administrator and modify its install. Open the battle.net launcher and select Warzone. Now expand its options and select Show in Explorer. Then, right-click the Warzone X file in the Explorer and select Properties. Now head to the Compatibility tab and check Run this program as administrator. Then, launch Warzone from Battle.net Launcher as normal and check if the crashing issue is cleared. If that did not work, open the Battle.net Launcher and select Warzone. Now, open its options and select Modify Install. Then uncheck the following, Campaign, Special Ops, Survival. Now apply the changes and launch Warzone to check if the crashing issue is resolved. Method 3. Disable the game mode of the PC. Click Windows, search for Game Mode, and then open Game Mode Settings. Now disable game mode by toggling its switch to the off position and if a low latency option is shown, disable it as well. Then head to the Xbox Game Bar tab and disable it. Now restart your system and upon restart, launch Warzone and check if the crashing error is clear. Method 4. Optimize the Warzone game in the NVIDIA GeForce Experience. Open the GeForce Experience utility and select the Call of Duty game. Now click on Optimize if the game is not optimized, and then launch Warzone to check if it is operating fine. Method 5. Disable conflicting system services. Click Window, search for Services, right-click on it, and in the mini menu, select Run as Administrator. Now, double-click an NVIDIA service, like NVIDIA Display Container LS, and change its startup type to Disable. Then, click on Stop and repeat the same for all other NVIDIA services, like NVIDIA Local System Container. Now launch Warzone and check if it is running fine without crashing. Method 6. Uninstall the Sonic device from the system. Right-click Windows and select Device Manager. Now expand the Audio Input and Out tab or Sound tab. Then right-click on the Sonic device and select Uninstall. Now, checkmark Delete the driver software of this device, if shown, for the Sonic device and click on Uninstall. Then wait till the driver is uninstalled and repeat the same to uninstall all the Sonic-related devices in the Device Manager like Sonic Studio Virtual, make sure to check all the tabs of Device Manager. Once done, right-click on Windows and select Apps and Features. Then expand Sonic Studio, or any other Sonic application, and click on Uninstall. Afterward, confirm to uninstall the Sonic application and follow the prompts on the screen to complete the uninstallation process. Once done, right-click on the volume icon in the system's tray and select Sounds. Now head to the Playback tab, right-click on a Sonic device, if shown, and select Disable. Then head to the Recording tab and disable a Sonic device, like Sonic Sound Mixer, if shown. Now restart your system and upon restart, launch Warzone and check it its error 6.154 is cleared. If that did not work and the Sonic device re-emerges in the device manager, then check if uninstalling the Realtek device in the device manager, restarting your system, and only using the generic audio driver solves the problem. Method 7. Clean boot windows and uninstall conflicting applications. To start, pressing Windows key, then type in msconfig and then hit the Enter key. On the System Configuration window that opens up, switch to the Services tab. There, check the Hide All Microsoft Services tick box provided. After doing that, click the Disable All button and then hit Apply. With that done, switch to the Startup tab and click on the Open Task Manager option. On the Task Manager window, click on the apps provided one by one and then click the Disable option. Once you have done all of that, go ahead and restart your computer.
After your PC boots up, see if the problem is still there? Besides, the following applications are reported to cause error 6.154 for Warzone and if your system has any such application, you may uninstall it. Afterburner, Discord, Aquasuite, Gamefirst, Razer Synapse. Method 8. Increase the size of the paging file of the system. Click Windows, search and open Advanced System Settings. Now open Settings in the Performance section and head to the Advanced tab. Then, click on Change in the Virtual Memory section and uncheck Automatically Manage Paging File Size for All Drives. Now, select the System Drive in the Drives section and select Custom Size. Then, in the Initial Size box, enter the recommended value, and in the Maximum Size box, enter the currently allocated value. Now click on Set and then click on Apply, OK. Then, restart your system and upon restart, launch Warzone and check if its crashing problem is solved. If not, check if setting the initial size to 1.5x RAM and maximum size to 3x RAM clears out the Warzone error. Method 9. Delete Warzone Player Folder in the Documents directory. Right-click Windows and select Run, type Documents, then press Enter. Now open the Call of Duty folder and delete the Players folder. Then launch Warzone and check if it is clear of the crashing problem. If that did not work, check if switching the player's skin solves the problem. Method 10, Scan and Repair the Game Files of Warzone Open the Battle.net Launcher and select Warzone, now open its options and select Scan and Repair. Now, wait till the scan and repair process is complete. Once done, launch the Warzone game and check if its crashing issue is resolved. Method 11, Reinstall the system's graphics driver and related application. Right-click Windows and select Device Manager. Now, expand Display Adapters and right-click on the display device, like NVIDIA. Then, select Uninstall and in the resulting menu, checkmark Delete the driver software of this device. Now click on the Uninstall button and wait till the driver is uninstalled. Once uninstalled, right-click on Windows and select Apps and Features. Now expand the graphics utility, like NVIDIA GeForce Experience, and click on Uninstall. Then confirm to uninstall the graphics utility and follow the prompts on the screen to uninstall it. Once done, restart your system and upon restart, let the Windows install a generic display driver, if it tries. Now launch Warzone and check if the crashing error 6.154 is cleared. If the issue persists, check if reinstalling the latest graphics driver solves the problem. If that did not work, check if uninstalling the graphics driver with a third-party uninstaller like Display Driver Uninstaller DDU, and then reinstalling the driver solves the problem. Method 12. Disable XMP in the system's BIOS. There can be certain BIOS settings, like XMP, that can cause the Warzone 6.154 error as these settings may impact the system's ability to properly handle the game's modules. In this scenario, editing the related BIOS settings may clear the Warzone error. Method 13. Reinstall the Warzone game. If none of the above solutions help you, then you need to reinstall the game. If you have any queries or feedback, leave a comment in the below given comment box.